Hey everybody, this is the new toy I alluded to in a different uh, comment section. This is an Alpha Smart Pro, and what it, I don't know if you know anything about it, I'll try to leave a link so you can uh, look it up like Wikipedia or whatever. Okay, now what this does is, it's, if you're familiar with a Tandy Model 100, this is very similar, okay? It's got NVRAM, and you type in it, you type a document of a certain size, I can't remember, and you save it as one of these, right? File 1 through file 8. That's what is on the F keys instead of just F1 through F8, right? So that's what you do. And then if you look over here, you got a few ports. This is power, and this is like a PS2 port for PC, and this is like an S-Video to go to a Mac or, sorry, PC, PS2 port, and there's a program that you use. It looks just like a key, old school keyboard or mouse. Well, not old school, but, you know, PS2, personal system 2. And this looks like an S-Video cable, and I believe that's the Apple Data Bus, because this is Mac, says Mac here, Mac slash 2GS. So that's what those do. All right, and you got a little LCD screen. LCD, right? And on the back, that's pretty much it, on and off. Okay, let me grab it and show you. These were used a lot in schools. Alpha Smart Pro Instructions runs off two double A's. This came from the Socorro School District, right? Okay, now, I got the screws out of it, and I can actually show you. You hit the little switch, turns it on, the screen fires up, and there comes file opening file one, that's it, right? That's what this does. Now, a couple of little hacks you can do are get a keyboard cable for the PC side of things and a USB adapter. And I've done this on the other model that I have, the little blue one, right? Uh, you start Word, you plug this in, and it acts like a keyboard, right? And that's, well, that's neat, but you, we have keyboards, what's the point, right? So this is pretty much obsolete and defunct. Well, not defunct, because it works. All right, now, I take everything apart. I took this cover off, and the first thing I noticed is how much more populated everything was on this uh, board, right? The next thing I noticed, I doubt you'll be able to see this, this is a 68K processor. So this is, in effect, a single board computer with a 68K processor, and that is awesome. Okay, uh, if you look here, this is the LCD connector, but there's also a solder pad for another LCD connector. And I'm like, what? What is this? What can I do? You know, I'm, I have not done any homework on this at all. I just got this today, turned it on, put a couple batteries in it, and it works. Okay, that's it. That's all I've done. Then I opened it up and I saw 68K. I'll annotate exactly which one it says it is on there. But this is neat because this is the heart of a Genesis, right? And I'm pretty sure this has the same, if not more, RAM than a Genesis. So you see where I'm going with this? Genesis with a keyboard. That's going to be a fun little project. Or maybe an Atari ST clone, you know, portable ST. Let's see, put this back down. Put I've got a laptop screen in the back room that is like really big compared to this, but that would be cool, wouldn't it? So I'm gonna see what I can make this thing do. Document it so everybody because these are dirt cheap. I paid 10 bucks for this, right? And I was quite happy as just this thing, just this keyboard, and I was like, huh, neat toy. Then I saw the 68K in there, and I was like, holy cow, this is a Genesis or an Atari ST, either one. That's cool. Okay, well, I will annotate. Keep, in, uh, keep a lookout. I'll be annotating with part number here and anything else I can think of that's pertinent that I'm forgetting in this video, okay? All right, thanks for watching. Well, let me go ahead and... This is socketed, right? This is Alpha Smart Pro version V2.1.3. So I think this can be, um, well, I know this can be replaced, but what to replace it with, right?
what do I want to replace this ROM with? And I want to find out what kind of ROM this is specifically. And I think I can Google that. There's some lots of hardware documents on this thing out there. Okay, for real, that's all I got. I'll annotate. Check back in about 10 minutes after this video is done. Thanks for watching, y'all. Take it easy. Bye-bye.